All right, now we hadn't seen any shockers. Well, at least in my opinion, there weren't any shocking moves so far. But this one would be the first one with the Ravens letting go of Nigel Warrior. Now, we remember Nigel Warrior. He was somebody that hung around with the Ravens last year on the practice squad. He was an undrafted free agent. Um, and then this year, it was looking like, it was really looking like he might actually make the team. Uh, he had a strong preseason, uh, and then in training camp and whatnot, he was, he's a safety, but it was said that they were trying him out at cornerback. And then we saw him in those preseason games. Uh, he, that's one thing that I really loved about him the most was his tackling. He is not afraid to come up and tackle, wrap up, and he will bring you down. Once you make contact with him, or once he makes contact with you, you're not going to be getting much further. So, shout out to Nigel Warrior. I, I really thought, especially after the Sean Wade trade, which I still don't like, but I understand. But even, uh, especially after that trade, I was like, okay, yeah, Warrior, yeah, he's, he's going to be here. He's going to be here. Young guy, play some safety, play some corner. And you know, with Ravens defense, the more you can do. That's all it's about. The more you can do, the better off you are. Uh, especially when it comes to defense. But anyway, now uh, he will pass through waivers. Now you got to feel like this is somebody that the Ravens, if he makes it through waivers, you got to feel like they're definitely going to bring him back to the practice squad. You feel like, like he almost, like he has to, if he passes through waivers. Now, uh, there could be teams like the, Patri the Patriots. You know they love some old Ravens defensive players now. If you play defense for the Ravens, Patriots, they, they got an eye on you. Um, but I just, I don't think he's going to make it back. I, I really don't. If he does, great. Awesome. But I don't think he's going to make it back. Now, it could be one of those things where since we see these players play, we see every single play that they make uh, in the games and whatnot, then we could be having a closer view on them than most people would. Um, so we may value them more than other teams would. But at the same time, I still don't think he's going to make it. I don't think he's going to make it back to the Ravens. Uh, but only time will tell. So, like Nigel Warrior is, at least for now, and maybe for good when it comes to the Ravens. But we'll see. But anyway, I'm out.